What's up, what's up, everybody? You already know Hip Hop Weekly is in the building with the hottest female MC in the game right now. Let them know who you are. Bonnie Godiva, Y.O. Stand Up. You already know. So what brings you out here to SOBs, and what are you looking to change in the culture of hip hop and music overall? Um, what brought me is I came for, to host A Success Sundays, and the owner Excel hit me like uh, he would like to put together a collaboration of artists. I definitely work with a couple artists that I try to bring around with me as I'm building my own buzz. I brought a few platforms like High Times Magazine, uh, Cannabis Cup, uh, like SOBs now, like a few venues that I've done myself where I can bring artists and show different artists' levels and skills. So that's what tonight is about, everybody showing their skills, different artists, and collaborating and showing love for the independent. That's what's up. That's what's up. I commend you because you're an artist yourself, and you're showing love to other people that's on the come up. We know that you had, you know, a lot of success in the battle world. You know, battling some of the hottest females, but they wasn't topping you because you you still standing out here tall on your own too. So, what current projects are you working on right now, and what people can expect from this new project? You can definitely expect versatility. Um, I show a different range of things. Like I don't consider myself just a hip hop artist. I am an artist, so that covers different things. And music is a feeling to me. So the title of my tour is I'm Not a Genre. So my music displays that I'm not a genre. So that's what you could expect from my album that's gonna drop. You could expect some film work. You could expect uh, more com comedy stuff coming up. So you can expect a different range of things, like I said. I definitely want to showcase that I'm just a creative. When you're a creative, there's no genre or lane that you cannot do. I like how you don't lock yourself in a box because you get to express different parts of you and who you are as a spiritual person first and foremost and an artist second, you know what I'm saying? So that's what's up. So um, I see that you said you work with Hot Times Magazine, you're working with SOBs and stuff like that. Are you looking to branch off and do partnerships with other brands? Like, what, what are some of your goals that you have? I definitely do brand ambassadorship. That's one of the strong points that has brought me from being a battle rapper to being an entertainer and artist. I do a lot of branding, so I work with Magical Butter, who sponsors, um, you know, things that I do with can uh, High Times Cannabis Cup and things of that nature. Shout out to Magical Butter. There's a few that I actually post on my Instagram a lot. So if you look at my Instagram, there's always a succession of companies that I always post. So those are the ones that are my vendors or sponsors or my affiliates that I work with to make my career what it is. Well, I commend you. I can't wait to, you know, participate and some more, uh, you know, business endeavors and all of that that you got going on because, you know, I actually look up to you. I've been watching you for a while. I know you've been in the battlefield killing it and all that. Do you actually have any battles coming out? I've been kind of slow with it for the past year because, to be honest, I've been trying to transition. I didn't start being a battler to be a battle rapper. I started it to be a platform to something greater. So since while now and other opportunities and I started to be greater, I'm not saying that I'm stepping away from battle rap for good, but I'm just saying I've been a little bit more withdrawn because there's a bigger picture. So I will be back, you know, I'll be back doing what I do. I do have one on January 18th in LA. That was the last one I committed to before I really started doing my music. So come out to that and see what it is. Y'all make sure y'all go and do that. She going to blaze that stage and set whoever's in that ring on fire. So y'all go tune into that. But um, where can people find you at on social media? At Bonnie Godiva on everything. And shout out to AOK Hair Company. They've been rocking with me the longest. I almost forgot them. AOK Hair Company. Definitely fuck with them in Philly. So uh, find me on at Bonnie Godiva on everything. Bonnie like Bonnie and Clyde Godiva like the chocolate. I do follow up back, show love back. Let me know what's up. And I do got to ask you this last question. If you could collaborate with anybody dead or alive, who would it be? And it doesn't have to just be music. It could be business, too. I say Big L on the music-wise. And um, let's see. I got to think of somebody really, really good. I would have to say Rob Green. He's still alive. I, I, on business-wise, Rob Green. Those are two legendary names. Y'all, y'all know what it is. Y'all tuning in to HipHopWeekly.com. Y'all gotta show, y'all gotta show Bonnie. God, God, I say Bonnie got diva. I don't know who I'll be doing that, but <laughs> that's all right, Godiva. Bonnie Godiva, yeah. she out here doing her thing. Y'all make sure y'all tune into her movement, support it. Don't be a stranger out here, man. We need y'all, and y'all need us. So let's keep the culture alive by, you know, supporting one another.